Hello everyone, welcome to another Premiere Pro video. Today I'm going to show you how to reduce wind noise in Premiere Pro. Now this is very simple. So as you can see, we have a clip right here. Uh, it's not a clip of someone talking, but you can apply this as well on the clips if someone is talking as well. So um, first of all, what we need to do is we need to go to the effects panel and type in the noise right here. You will have the noise right here. Now we can uh, use that or what we can also use is a high pass filter. In this tutorial, we're going to use high pass filter. So go and click on high pass filter, drag and drop it right here. And as you can see, we can go to effect controls and here we have high pass filter. So let's listen to this right here. As you can see right now, it's a really better sound than before. Um, obviously before it was, if we go to control Z, we can see before. So it's a really, really good sound. So make sure to put high pass filter here. You can also play around with these settings right here, obviously. Now the second thing that you can do is you can go to your audio right here, go to audio and here go to dialogue. And then here you can reduce noise uh, from the dialogue. So this is basically for the podcast for people that are talking in the video so if we play as you can see it's already much much better right we can also reduce rumble as well uh, and obviously the hum we can play around with these right here as well uh, if you want clip volume as well if you want clip volume and stuff like that now go back to this uh, section right here what we can also do is we can actually go and zoom in on this and right click and we can edit this uh, you know in Adobe Audition. Now if you don't have Adobe Audition that's okay you can skip this video or skip this part of the video but we can click edit clip in Adobe Audition. What this will do is this will render and replace the clip right and right now we'll have to wait for Adobe Audition to as you can see to uh, go into Adobe Audition click just the system audio hardware settings change. Okay, would you like to review? Yes, we can click okay and just that's it. So right now what we can do here is we can actually remove the noise. So um, if we go, as you can see right here, we can play this. So if we play this, right, it's probably going to be not a noise, right? So this here is not a noise, this here is a noise. So if you go here and if we go to effects, we can go noise reduction, capture noise print, and then we can control A, click control A, effects, noise reduction, noise reduction process. And here, as you can see, we have noise reduction process. So we can also click here, capture noise print to capture the noise print, but that's pretty much it. Click apply and that will capture the uh, noise print. Now, once that is done, we can just exit, click yes, save changes. This will save changes in Adobe as well. So let's play. As you can see, it's really changed a lot of the wind noise that we had in Premiere Pro. So that's pretty much how to do it. Very simple, it's very easy. If you have any questions or comments, comment down below and we'll see you in the next video. Thank you guys for watching.